SKA hosts Abdomobile East. KHL's best versus KHL's worst. First place team plays last place team. Just 25 seconds into the first, Kevin Dahlman dumps the puck in. It goes off the boards and into the slot to Peter Pruka, and he scores 1-0 SKA. Some may call it a lucky bounce, but you have to be ready for it as a defenseman. You can't let the puck get into your slot so easily. Halfway through the first now, SKA on the power play. Mortensen to Thorson to Kevin Dahlman. Scores 2-0 SKA. We often refer to Mortensen Thorson duo as the driving force of SKA, but we often forget that these two got a huge support from Kevin Dahlman. Second period now, and check this out. Mortensen to Thorson, spin around a pass. Pruka, backhand, they score. What a beauty. 3-0 SKA. I know they're playing the last team in KHL standings, but they pull off plays like this regardless of whom they play. It's just scary. Pruka scores his second of the night. Less than two minutes after that, SKA on the power play. Dahlman gives the puck to Thorson. He waits, aims, shoots, and goes water bottle. 4-0 SKA. And Thorson gets his fourth point of the night. He was a part of every SKA's goal in this game. That's exactly what people expect of him now that Kovalchuk and Tarasenko have gone to the NHL and Patrick delivers. Amazing. Midway through the third, Avnimo released on the power play. Stanislav Shmakin has the puck, goes five hole on Ilya Ejav and beats him, ruins the shutout, 4-1. After Mbili still has over 9 minutes left in regulation, but even at this point it's clear that it's just a consolation goal. Schmacken scores his 14th of the season, by the way. Not bad. That's it for goals in this one. Thorson racks up 4 points, Dahlman gets 3, while Mortensen and Pruka get 2 each. 4-1 SKA final.